uh, starting with animation blocking, uh, the animator can submit a draft version of that shot, and then we go to rounds. The director comes by, let's say he has notes. So there's some backwash, right? There's an artistic note. It goes back to animation blocking. Um, but let's say he's happy with it. Let's say the director is fine. It goes to final animation. There could be more steps here, but I'm, I'm simplifying this as much as I can. Um, final animation is submitted. The assets are put into the repository for review. There's another set of rounds. The director comes by, or this goes in a sweat box. If he has notes, goes back. Uh, if he has no notes, it goes to a default simulation render. So uh, this is a render where we throw the default cloth sim, if we have one, onto our character and see what explodes. Um, if something blows up, we put that asset on hold. Not the whole scene, but just the cloth asset. That gets put on hold. Um, some sim and animation adjustments are made. And um, then we're ready for review of, of that entire uh, uh, bit. Um, we'll do a rough render at this point, once the cloth is working fine with prop animation, set dressing, uh, and the updated uh, camera. Maybe there's been a camera change or a slight adjustment. Um, the places where I've worked, we've had the ability to have layout define a camera, but have the animators have a parallel camera, which is a, a, an exact copy that they can change if they want. Then that goes back, and the layout, uh, the head of layout and the director decide whether the animator's changes are good. And if they, oh, I like what the animator did, great. If they don't like what the animator did, it's out. Or, what's an interesting blend, maybe they like what the animator's getting at, but it's a kind of a rough move, it's got a hit in it or something, and the layout artist will go and kind of, you know, just smooth that out, send it downstream. Uh, we go to Sweatbox, this is where sort of the animator and the director and so forth get their final, not their final bite at the apple, but hopefully uh, their last good bite at the apple. Um, if there are any cleanup notes, you know, hey, there's an interpenetration in this arm or the foot's going through the floor, we can't have that, um, that's addressed. And then finally, uh, that goes out for um, uh, lighting and compositing to work with. And if we take out the backwash and the, the holds, uh, this is what this looks like. So it's actually very simple. Animation blocking, final animation, default sim render, rough render with prop animation, set dressing, blah, 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 sweat box, uh, and you're out. <clears throat> Within an asset itself, you can apply this to, let's say, character development. So if we're starting with character design and going through to our screen test, we can see how these little modules can stack from one end to the other. 